this is the main part of that video. <laughs> there was lots of word salad, I know that. But you need to know the background story, right? Yes, the exact uh, three month strategy that how I learned speaking English. Hi everybody from one of the most beautiful day in a life and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, this is Hayrunisa. I'm an English learner since 2015. And in this channel, I'm sharing language learning tips. <laughs> well, in this video, we're gonna go ahead and talk about how I learned speaking English in three months. Well, in 2015, I started college and I chose a program that the education language was English. So I had to prove my English level and I took an exam. Thank God that I failed. The best thing that ever happened to me. So for this reason, for a year, I went to foreign language school and I studied English specifically. Well, the thing is the first term of that year, I really didn't try to speak English. I was just going to school, taking my lessons and coming back to home. And I was just, you know, doing the things, the homework and so on. But the second term, I was like really active because I really wanted to learn. Like this was a chance that I can never have. So at the end of the year, I realized that I really cannot speak English, but word by word, yes, I can communicate. Well, at the end of the second term, I was feeling really disappointed about myself because I tried really hard, but I still cannot speak. In the faculty, there was a computer room for students. You can go and do your homework, study and so on. The last few weeks I went there and I told myself, okay, like that's enough. I want to find myself a role model. And one day I found AJ Hoke. So after that point, well, I passed all of my exams and the term ended. So here is the exact uh, three month strategy that how I learned speaking English. This is the main part of that video. <laughs> there was lots of word salad, I know that. But you need to know the background story, right? Yes, right. <laughs> he answers, right. The thing is, I told my family to help me and thank God that they accepted. So I didn't consume any Turkish and I practiced on how you can forget your native language. And this was my exact strategy to learn English. Um, when I figured out about AJ Hoke, I searched, you know, Play Store. I found an application called Effortless English with the name of his system. And I saw a six months of lessons and each module had four or three lessons and in the first program he was explaining that like what should be your mentality like how you like what should be your approach to learn a new language and in the first lesson he was talking about you should be listening every single lesson uh, for a week and practice on your um, speaking understanding and so on so I had a transcript on that application uh, and I had a vocabulary notebook. First, I was reading that transcript. I was taking notes of the words I don't know. I was checking them and I was reading one more time until I feel like, yes, I understand. So every single day, two hours in the morning and two hours uh, at night, I was listening those lessons. In the morning, I was going for a walk or sometimes I was washing the dishes, sometimes helping mom on the house chores and listening him at the time. So for two hours, I was listening him and at the same time I was doing something else because just sitting and listening was really boring. Like I also tried that and it was really boring. This was like AJ Hook strategy, like you consume English in a natural way, you understand. I also wanted to speak with my own way, like I was watching three different TV shows, one of them with English subtitles, one of them with no subtitles, so I was checking how much I understand. I was challenging myself and one of them was Merlin, it was a British TV show. I was watching with Turkish subtitle in the beginning, but then I quit it because, you know, using Turkish, my native language really doesn't helpful. It's not really beneficial when you're learning another language. So White Color, Pretty Little Liars and Merlin, those were the three TV shows that I was watching every day. And at least for like, if we say like, I was watching at least five episodes from each. And after watching those TV shows, I was listening to AJ Hawk podcasts and then before i sleep like before two hours i was recording myself at the time i had an old-fashioned 
computer and I was opening my webcam and talking to myself for 30 minutes. I was summarizing my day. I was talking about what I learned at the time, like that day. I was trying to create a sentences. I was making a lot of mistakes and it was really fun at the time, I remember. And after I finished recording, I rewatching myself for another 30 minutes. Like this was pretty much my daily schedule for learning English. Also, before I sleep, like I go to my bed lying and then I was opening YouTube and watching AJ Hoke um, videos. So he was in some videos, he was talking about comfort zone. He was talking about motivation. He was talking about the movie technique. So I was watching TV series such as White College was my favorite and in one of his video he was talking about movie technique uh, so I learned shadowing at the time and I practiced on my favorite TV show so this was pretty much thing that I did every day I spoke every day I listened I actively used the language actually this is the key point where I focused understanding and using what I learned while speaking English and in time I realized that my speech is getting better the vocabulary I use is getting improved increase and my intonation the rhythm that I use when I speak English I realized that and as much as I gave myself feedback while recording myself I get better this was the key that actually like how I learned how to speak English. You might think that, you might question that. Hey girl, was it that really easy? Well, it was not that really easy. Sometimes I was feeling really bad. I was feeling like droning, like keep going with the same schedule every day was not, not really easy. I had a mirror in the back side of me, in, in this wall. I was standing in front of that mirror almost every single morning and repeating myself out loud that, hey Hayunisa, you are a great English speaker. One day you're going to speak English like a native. One day you're going to forget all about those. You're going to express yourself the best way you can. You are a great mistake maker. Don't worry about it too much. Well, actually in the beginning, I really didn't believe in myself, but in time, as much as I kept reminding myself, I start to believe that. So guys, I am at the end of my words. Hope this video was helpful. Regardless, as always, no matter what, I will see you in the next video. Bye for now. <clears throat> Ice in my veins, I've been driving this train. Years in this lane, there's no stop in this flame Cause I came to the game and I changed it to play How I like rearranged it to my own domain Yeah, I got what it takes